Ah, Florida, home of wonderful beaches, beautiful wildlife, and wait a minute, what's that noise? I just spawned in. I just spawned. No! No! Where do I go? Everything is blowing up! Where do I go? Wait, this isn't Florida. This is the wrong flag. Welcome back to the greatest game that makes me go. Oh my god, he just died! If you don't know, this is the Galactic Contention mod for Squad. A couple months back, the mod was finally updated to work with the ICO, and I was finally able to try it out, and boy, did it blow me away. Do it. Oh sh Um, was that a purple tracer? Was that, a, was that a guy floating that I just saw? What they, do they would they never, right? Exactly, man. Like, why would they shoot him? Two seconds later. I just want to talk. Ah! I just want to talk. They're not shooting. They're shooting. They're shooting. Oh my <laughs> god. Shut the fuck up. Bitch, back the fuck up. No, <laughs> they killed you. No. Stop killing my friend. Oh my god, I can't hear it. Ah! Look at the sticker. That is so cold. Oh my god. Whoa! Oh my god, it does a spin. It does a spinny spin. Ah! If you've never played this mod before or maybe never heard of it, it's a mod based around the Clone Wars era of Star Wars lore, meaning vehicles, weapons, and both the CIS and Republic troops have been added to the game. But the mod also adds in some additional tweaks and features outside of the factions and maps. For one, weapon handling, stamina, and general player feel has been tweaked to better match up with the Star Wars lore, which makes sense considering you're playing as a clone or a droid literally built for combat and nothing more. I'm one of those crazy people that love the ICO to the point where I can't even play mods like Middle Eastern Escalation without feeling all weird. Oh my god, I'm stupid! Oh my god, I'm stupid! So when I started playing this mod, I thought it'd be a similar experience, but I was way wrong. I thought you just put enemy combatant. I got him. Hello. Oh my god, they have a turret in there. It's pushing into commander to your northeast. Watch out. It's outside by the stairs. Knife it. I did it. I did it. I knifed it. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh my god. Ow. Magna on our, on our northeast, northeast. I'm going to the atmosphere! Oh god! No! Get me down! Actually, I'm gonna save my bandy for you. Oh my! I think I got that guy with the pistol. There's a guy in our hab, guy in our hab. I'm gonna go in and kill him. Got him. Oh my god. No! Money! 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 
Alright, time to push, I suppose. Eyes on the sniper. Charlie and third. No way! I think weapon handling is handled extremely well. Recoil is there, but it's not outrageous. And running to objectives doesn't feel like a one hour hike simulator. I'm so slow. Oh my god, they are so fast. They're so fast. I'm not saying you should be able to run at Mach 10 on Vanilla Squad, but running around the map doesn't feel like I'm stabbing myself in the gut repeatedly. What? So what? There's also way more distinct and fun roles. Obviously, you have your normal medics and riflemen. Thank you. But there's also commandos and super battle droids that can take a lot of damage. Bro, did not expect that. Radio is near us. Uh, ah, there's a guy! Jesus, those commandos take so much bullets, man. Magma guards that can go invisible. Invisibility cloak. That is so cool. So how long does this last? Like... Oh my god. Okay. That is very cool. Go Jet ahead, troopers go, that can literally fly. All right, let's go for it. I'll distract them, boys. I'm dropping. Beautiful. And probably more I'm forgetting. Did I just... I just saw a guy to that northeast side. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Am I tripping? I might be tripping. That's sneaky. I got him! Oh, there's another guy! This melee. Oh my god, I punched them to death! There's also a whole lot of ambient props like birds and ships flying right above the planet. Oh my god, you can just slightly see the, the lights poking through the fog. That is scary, dude. Oh, that's so cool, man. The atmosphere of this mod is insane, bruh. Oh my god! Okay, I did not know it was gonna be right here. That's insane, dude. I was already pretty impressed with the mod, but you know what sealed the deal for me? Being eaten by an alligator. It's an alligator! Oh, it's a tank! <laughs> oh, don't kill me, what? You're probably tired of my yapping by now, so I'll just list off a few more features I absolutely love. There's working shields and shield generators, new artillery and bombardments, UI changes for certain classes like the super battle droid, flashlights, night vision, which I still haven't used since the darker day maps are way too bright and I've never been on a night map yet, new maps based on locations in Star Wars lore like Yavin 4 and Kashyyyk, droids can't be revived, which honestly makes sense. You constantly see them in the shows getting ripped apart and completely destroyed whenever they get shot. And so much more that I'm probably forgetting at this point. I Okay, this is a really cool feature, dude. Being able to pick up an entire vehicle. That's such a cool idea, man. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus Christ. 
Don't get me wrong, there are definitely flaws or at least things I dislike about the mod. Most games are invasion, which can last way too long for my taste, and is especially true in this mod when each faction seems like they have 700 tickets. I've also never driven the vehicles, but I hear from other players that they are awful to drive, both the flying vehicles and the normal ground vehicles. And my biggest complaint is I miss the suppression from Vanilla Squad. But that being said, it does make sense considering how many shots you can take and still return fire. And in universe, suppression might not be that effective anyway since clones and droids are trained from birth, meaning they are less likely to be suppressed. It's hard for me to play squad without the inclusion of the suppression mechanic, but this mod makes the game feel completely brand new so I don't really mind it. Don't get me wrong, it's a meat grinder, but in a fun way. It's a fun meat grinder. What? But yeah, that's all I got. I literally yapped myself into a headache. Thank you so much for watching. I don't know how you made it this far without being tired of me and my voice, but I really appreciate you. Enjoy your stay, and hopefully I'll see you next time when I tame my own army of gators and liberate the Wookiees.